My name is Robert with Web Developer Ninja, and today I want to talk with you about SKUs, and more specifically, SKUs in relation to inventory when it comes to an e-commerce store. So it's really easy when you're setting up your e-commerce store to maybe say, I don't really need SKUs, I've only got 20, 30 products, let's just use the product name and everything we will be fine and dandy. And that might work, and it might be okay with just 20 or 30 products, but let me really quickly go through why it's important from the get to have SKUs on your products. SKUs are going to make it easy for you to stock, keep track of where your stock is at in a graphical sort of way. So over here in WooCommerce, you, you've got all these reports that you can run. And having different SKUs, especially once this store does not have orders, but especially um, once you start getting orders, SKUs are going to allow you to have that. They're also going to allow you, allow you to track shrinkage and... Uh, maybe uh, low inventory spots so it's gonna allow you get to uniquely know when you need to order and replenish stocks so now you kinda know why you need SKUs on your e-commerce store let me show you how easy it is to add SKUs with WooCommerce so what we're gonna do is the first thing is come down to products and we've already got a couple products in this test site so we're actually going to add just real quickly add SKUs so in the product list, click quick edit, and on product data, this is where you would add your SKU. And ideally, you would take some time to strategically think what products you sell, what categories you sell, maybe different sizes, and come up with a SKU system. So we would say this is a gold premium sign. So we'd, we'd say uh, gold GLD sign and then we would say like give it some sort of number 929 and um, ideally you would have a system set up so if you've got different categories so especially in your WooCommerce store you set up your categories you'd want to have your SKUs so you'd be able to uniquely know what category they're in what price they're at all sorts of that all good information so that's how you add the SKU the quick way um, the other way you want to add it is if you're just adding a new product from scratch all you're gonna do is product name's gonna be here, long description, and boom, SKU, it's your first thing. Really important. So guys, on your e-commerce stores, even if they're just 10 or 20 products, get in the habit of using SKUs. It's gonna save you so much headache. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos.